Добрый день, дорогие друзья. Итак, мы с вами продолжаем изучать восьмой юнит. Откройте, пожалуйста, ваши учебники на странице 104. Цель сегодняшнего занятия – научиться применять английский язык в реальности. Для этого нам нужно знать фразы, при помощи которых мы можем построить диалог, когда вы заключаете какое-то соглашение, то есть договариваетесь о чем-то. Итак, давайте выполним упражнение первое. The following sentences appear in a dialogue. What is the dialogue about? Вам нужно догадаться по этим фразам, о чем идет речь в диалоге. Have you got any plans for Sunday? Do you want to come with me? When is it? It starts at 5.30. See you then. Итак, как вы можете ответить на данный вопрос? Примерный образец. The dialogue is about inviting another person to an event. Okay, итак, упражнение второе. Listen, read and check. Так вам нужно теперь послушать, прочитать диалог и проверить. Have you got any plans for Sunday? I've got a tennis lesson at 10 o'clock in the morning. Why? There's a football match at the Astana Arena. Do you want to come with me? When is it? It starts at 5.30. Okay. I can meet you at the train station at four o'clock. See you then. Okay. Read the dialogue. Where do they want to go? When are they going to meet? Итак, нужно еще раз прочитать диалог и понять, куда собираются участники диалога и когда они собираются встретиться. They want to go to a football match at the Astana Arena. They are going to meet at four o'clock. Итак, вам нужно найти uh, синонимичные фразы данным фразам. Would you like to come to? Окей. Okay. И фраза с таким же значением звучит следующим образом. Do you want to come with me? Я вам показываю курсором, какая это фраза. Следующая фраза. What time is it? Можно заменить фразой when, uh, when is it? Далее, третья фраза. What plans have we got for Sunday? Можно заменить фразой Have you got any plans for Sunday? Итак, надеюсь, данный диалог вам понятен. Данные фразы нужно выучить, запомнить и применять в дальнейшем в следующих диалогах. Окей, okay. итак. Say the sentences below in your language. Have you got any plans for Sunday? Какие у тебя планы? Есть ли планы на воскресенье? Do you want to come with me? Не хочешь пойти со мной? When is it? Когда это? It starts at 5.30. Оно начинается в 5.30. See you then. Увидимся. Пока. Окей, okay. итак. Следующее упражнение мы выполним на странице 105. Вам нужно э, прочитать текст. Прочитать текст и перевести текст, понять его и выучить фразы из него. Но прежде чем вы прочтете текст, я хотела бы вам показать видео, для того, чтобы вам легче было переводить. Sports days. All over the world, all year round, people take part in big sports events. Lots of sports fans go to the events or watch them on TV. Let's take a look at two big events on the sports calendar. The Championships, Wimbledon, or as most people call it, Wimbledon is the oldest and most famous tennis tournament in the world. It takes place in London, England every year in June and July. Wimbledon is a special tournament. The players have to wear white clothes and they play on grass courts. Most players say that Wimbledon is their favourite tournament and the one they really want to win. Wimbledon is very popular. 
People travel from all over the world to see their favourite players. Some spectators camp overnight to get tickets to the best matches. People who don't have a ticket can watch matches outside on a big screen. Wimbledon is also famous for its dessert, strawberries and cream. Rain is also something that Wimbledon is famous for. Wimbledon is open to tourists all year round. There is a museum and visitors can go on a tour of the famous Centre Court. Why not visit to find out why tennis fans love Wimbledon so much? The President Cup takes place every year in June at the Astana Arena in Kazakhstan. It is a special football tournament for teenagers under 17 years old. Teams from many different countries take part. For example, you can see teams from China, Serbia or Spain. It is a great event to visit, full of skill, goals and excitement. It's also a wonderful chance for football fans to spot the stars of the future. Why not go to a match to see the next Lionel Messi in action? Are you a fan of sports? Which sports event would you most like to visit? данное видео вам поможет при переводе и чтении текста. Так, look at the pictures and read the title and the headings. What do you know about this event? Так, посмотрите на картинки, прочитайте заголовки. И как вы думаете, о чем данные события? Как можно ответить на этот вопрос? I know that Wimbledon is a tennis competition in the UK. I know that the Kazakhstan President Cup is for young players. What else would you like to know about them? Think of three questions. Что еще вы хотели бы узнать о них? Задайте три вопроса. Where is Wimbledon? How old do you have to be to play in the Kazakhstan President Cup? Where do players come from? Окей. Okay. Итак, сейчас я предлагаю вам послушать аудиозапись и при этом пытаться прочитать текст про себя, для того, чтобы вы понимали, Какое произношение должно быть? Sports Days. The Championships, Wimbledon. Every summer, a famous tennis competition takes place at Wimbledon, London, UK. Amazing players come from all over the world, and very famous ones play their matches on centre court. It's fun to go to Wimbledon. Apart from the exciting tennis matches, you can visit coffee shops and restaurants, or buy a takeaway picnic. People drink around 350,000 cups of tea and coffee at Wimbledon. Kazakhstan President Cup. The President Cup takes place every year in June at the Astana Arena, Kazakhstan. It is a special football tournament for teenagers under 17 years old. Teams from many different countries take part, from China to Serbia and Spain. It's a great event to visit if you want to spot the football stars of the future. Where is Wimbledon? Wimbledon is in London. How old do you have to be to play in the Kazakhstan President Cup? You have to be under 17 years old to play in the Kazakhstan President Cup. Where do players come from? Players in the Kazakhstan President Cup come from all over the world. Итак, надеюсь, вопросы, ответы на вопросы вам теперь ясны. Окей, okay. exercise 2, read again and answer the questions. Вам предлагают uh, ответить на вопросы. Если нужно, uh, прочитайте тексты еще раз. Where is Wimbledon? Wimbledon, London, UK, United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland. Okay. Who plays their matches on Centre Court? 
Amazing players come from all over the world and very famous ones play their matches on St. Gold. Where can you buy food and drink at Wimbledon? You can visit coffee shops and restaurants. When does the President Cup take place? The President Cup takes place every year in June. How old are the players in the President Cup? It's a special football tournament for teenagers under 17 years old. Окей. Okay. Итак, надеюсь, данное uh, задание вы выполнили верно. Итак, exercise free. Think of sport events in your country. When is it? Where is it? Who takes part? Why it is fun? Write a short text about it. Present to class. Итак, вам предлагается подумать о спортивном событии в вашем, стра вашей стране, когда это происходит, где, кто принимает участие, весело ли это мероприятие проходит. И вам предлагается написать короткий рассказ об этом мероприятии. Окей, я вам даю образцовый текст. Speed skating is popular in Kazakhstan. Every year we have national and international competitions. Most happen at the Alau Ice Palace in Astana in November to January. Racers come from all over Kazakhstan, Asia and the world. It's very fast and exciting. I think the best part is that you can skate on the ice yourself after the races have finished. Okay, and exercise for pronunciation. Произношение звуков А и звука У. Итак, listen and repeat this. А. Uh, fun. Cup. Summer. Culture, U, future, U, use, blue. Окей, на этом у нас урок завершен. Надеюсь, что вам была тема ясна и вы справились с заданием. Thank you very much. Be healthy.